Hey guys, just wanted to do a quick update. I haven't done one. I did get the shell back down onto the rolling chassis, whatever the fuck you want to call it. I made it, but I wanted to address a couple of things first. Uh, man, I, I, I posted, I, I've done quite a bit since the last video I did. Um, and I posted on Facebook a couple of different areas on the Sloppy Mechanics page. Boy, I tell you what, those motherfuckers are dumb, okay? They don't like anything that isn't outlast or they have no fucking vision, bro. Like, shut the fuck up. I want to show you the intake I made. Just enough for me to roll it outside because the car has been sitting in this bay that is this garage that is not mine for two months longer than I had planned. So, I needed to make an intake. They were laughing at my welds. I, I literally threw this together in about an hour and a half, okay? So I made it so it sits here. They're laughing at my fucking windshield cut. You can eat a dick, because the windshield company will take care of that. So that's what it looked like. It's all fucking twisted, and it's literally just enough for me to take this and roll it the fuck outside and have it, 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 the snow can snow on it. You know what I mean? It's to protect everything. Um, do I think I'm going to stay with this? No, I don't. <laughs> I originally started with um, just that flange up here and just a, like a four inch pipe. But I didn't want four inch, I kind of want five and a half inch. So I'm going to go, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to do two um, cone filters somewhere. Um, but man, you should have, I'm going to die in this thing because of the steering. Look, I got to show you. So the steering is literally just mounted so I can move this fucking thing from this bay to that bay to that bay. So you can eat a dick. I'm not driving on it, you fucking retards. Look, fucking relax. I used, and they're, they were laughing because I used, uh, Half inch swivels, just to fucking connect it, right? And then they were laughing at my plasma cut frame rails, right? That literally has no weight. Oh, back here, okay? You dumb bastards. <laughs> Look, the frame ends right there. The, the, the motor's right there. Back there, buddy, okay? I do have plates, oh my God. You guys are fucking retarded, some of you. It, it boggled my mind. But you know what? It's my car. I'm gonna build it the way the fuck I want. And if it runs, it runs. If it doesn't, I'll make it run. I don't care. Okay? So here we, <laughs> I mean, kinda wanted to just address that real quick. All I gotta do is wire it up. I got a trunk box made. Looking to put a, 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 a keg for a fuel tank. Battery's going on one of the other sides, I'm not sure. But uh, I'm getting ready. My fuel pump should be in tomorrow. I'm, or it was supposed to be in yesterday. But the snowstorm and everything like that. and The, the shipping's all fucked up with this pandemic. And uh, so my pump should be in tomorrow. And I got the fuel line. Got my barb fittings to be able to connect it. I'm waiting. I'm actually going to go pick up two new AN90s. Today, I gotta leave here in a minute to go get it. Cut this in half. I, I, I mean, I'm, I'm probably two hours worth of work away, maybe three hours worth of work away from firing this up as far as motor-wise and electronical wire up goes. Uh, making the fuel cell is gonna take me, I don't know, two hours. But here we are, that's it. Keep checking in, guys. I really appreciate the support. Uh, uh, any tips, I want, I want them, you know, laugh, cry, I don't, you know, help me, I don't care, or don't, later.